Tonight, the search continues for a man who police say critically injured a woman in a shooting. It happened near St. Peter's in a residential area on Rosemary Court and St. Peter's Howell Road. Five in your science, Diamond Palmer is live at the St. Charles County Police Department with some new information for us. Diamond. Well, Mike, neighbors tell me this has caused a disruption in what they say is a peaceful neighborhood. Tonight, St. Charles County Police telling us they will not release a detailed description of the suspect because they feel it would compromise the investigation. It is kind of heartbreaking just because like this was more of a peaceful area. John Wynn says that peace was disrupted Monday evening. A 37 year old woman was shot multiple times on Rosemary Court near St. Peter's Howe Road. She was rushed to the hospital with critical injuries. Another person identified as a witness called 911. Wynn says the shooting made him worry for children who play outside often. Anything could have ricochet hit one of them kids because they're consistently out here roaming the streets and playing around. And I can say that for sure. Police say the suspected shooter is a man, but they have not given a detailed description because they don't want to compromise the investigation. Police believe he knows the victim. This uh, was not some random incident. The two individuals um, had some type of relationship or at least interaction with each other. St. Charles County Police say the investigation remains open and active with many leads. They were notified Tuesday afternoon the victim had surgery and was listed in stable condition. But questions still remain as to why the shooting happened. We had evidence that we found outside and inside. And so we're trying to you know, ascertain exactly where it occurred. Uh, we're getting conflicting reports from another individual um, who is, was, was interviewed last night. Wynn says he wishes the incident didn't end in gunfire. They have more vengeance going out towards more people with more malice going out rather than trying to speak about it and trying to work things out. This evening, St. Charles County Police tell us there is no threat to the community and a reminder that this is an open and an active investigation. Reporting live here in St. Charles County, Diamond Palmer, 5 on your side.